what happens is as much as you don't worry about those thoughts ignorance and avoidance difference or a small difference between ignorance and avoidance the war against these uh, you know thoughts similarly during break times you know if he's coming close to you you are just going away from him you know college events and during those events you try to avoid him and a time comes when you are even trying to skip the events because your life has become hell so the beautiful college life has become really difficult for you hello assalamu alaikum uh, i'm ishfaq ahmed from my youtube channel so today we'll talk about the repeated thoughts or bothering thoughts or overwhelming thoughts or you know whenever those thoughts are coming like repeated thoughts those create a lot of problems for you you are stuck you know uh, you, you are not spending normal life whatever the content of those thoughts are those are really bothering thoughts you know those are making your life difficult now what happens is you talk to professionals you talk to your friends and family and they always tell you that okay you stay away from those thoughts don't care about those thoughts those thoughts are just nothing you know you should not worry about those thoughts but what happens is as much as you don't worry about those thoughts those thoughts become like more painful for you for example the thought is coming and you are you know trying to stay away from that thought you are not trying to think about uh, that thought but that thought is coming again and again now what you need to understand here is what your professionals and friends have asked you to do is basically you need to ignore those thoughts but actually you are trying to avoid those thoughts so you need to understand the difference between ignorance and avoidance right if you understand this thin difference or a small difference between ignorance and avoidance you will definitely uh, you know conquer uh, the war against these uh, you know thoughts now let me give you an example you are three friends x y and z so you are for example you are y and your friend is z and there is mr x so mr x is a very naughty person he's always choking he's always taunting he's always making fun of you and you whenever he makes fun you become upset you know if he's sitting on uh, the class uh, let's say on desk number one you just go back and sit on desk number 10 and then that friend comes close to you and you go away from him similarly during break times you know if he's coming close to you you are just going away from him then he will follow you and he will make fun of you and even if there are you know college events and during those events you try to avoid him and a time comes when you are even trying to skip the events because your life has become hell so the beautiful college life has become really difficult for you so you are really upset because of that friend why because you are trying to avoid him now your other friend mr z he deals with mr x in an entirely different manner so first day when mr x uh, was taunting on Mr. Z. He said, hey, come on, man, you are a very naughty person. Oh, really? Oh, you see something on my uh, forehead? Oh, yeah, 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 I'll, I'll do that. You are very naughty, by the way. You have a good sense of humor, you know. So this way, Mr. Z, who also doesn't like the fun or the jokes of Mr. X, he slowly, slowly makes him, him a friend and both of them become comfortable at certain stage. So just apply this example on your repeating thoughts issues what you are doing whenever thought comes you just say oh really uh, I'm going to avoid it you know I need to stay away from him oh my god he's, that's coming again. So in this way basically what you are doing is you are trying to avoid that thought while a person who tries to ignore that thought he will say okay you are a thought you are just the same thought which you know uh, which has been coming to me many times okay come on take me over it's okay i'm fine i know you will create anxiety for me so it's okay just come on carry on so this is an example of ignorance so you always need to understand the difference between ignorance and avoidance so if you have any sort of problem with your repeated you know your thoughts coming again and again to your mind just make sure you ignore them and you never try to avoid them. Thank you so much.